wait a minute, what is this? It had such dynamics and it had such feeling that I realized if I can bring my father's classical and lay my own to that. First time I heard Joey play, I was like, wow, if we can get that guy, we'll be good. I'm not a technical player. I don't play real fancy. I do one thing really, really good. It's about my gut. It's about what I feel inside. That's all that I have to go on. But just as Aerosmith was reveling in its first taste of success, the Brotherhood was severely bruised. I clearly saw that Joe was pulling away, and it really bugged me. Joe Perry was spending more and more time away from the band in the company of his girlfriend, Alyssa Jarrett. Alyssa's constant presence aggravated an already tense environment on the road, where increasing drug use was breeding resentment and jealousy. You know, there was some more anger there. I mean, here's a guy that uh, I've been waiting all my life to have as a friend, never mind be in a band. And he was cool looking, had long black hair. Um, and he really doesn't give a about me. He'd rather be off with Alyssa, who was a fox. And looking back in retrospect, I don't blame him because he was getting laid and I wasn't. I mean, the sexual tension between Steve and Alyssa and Joe Perry. Back then, I mean, it was just, it was incredible. And they played with it.